Show me the goods. Welcome back to my channel. Nancy back. I'm back. The makeup look looks good. Stop stealing. welcome or welcome back to my channel if you're new here my name is Nadia and today we're gonna jump right into my hygiene collection I am currently in my bathroom right now hence the echo if you can hear it um, I'm gonna start the video in here and then I'm going to take the video into my makeup room and finish in there I'm starting in here because of course I have my stuff separated all of my body washes and my body scrubs are in here in my bathroom so I didn't want to have to pull everything into one room because it was just too much work and I was trying to make this quick and easier for myself as far as the filming process so I'm in my bathroom and that's where we're gonna start okay okay let's get to it <laughs> so the first thing I'm gonna talk to you guys about is my you know what The first thing that I'm gonna talk to you guys about, I'm sorry if I'm too close, but I have my camera right here. I'm sitting on the toilet. So, but anyways, the first thing I'm gonna talk to you guys about is this coconut oil. I only use two things to shave. I haven't used this before because I try to use up, like when it comes to this stuff, I don't tend to buy a lot of products because it's shaving. Like, it's a shave cream or a shave oil. Like, how many products do you need to shave? At least me, I don't need all that. Some things, it's just not that serious for me. So, I have, oh, I'm out of breath. I was moving that freaking thing this heavy. <laughs> but I have this um, shave gel and then this coconut oil shave oil. This is almost empty. This is the skin cement regular old thing that we always use. Well, a lot of people always use. This is Coconut Delight. This scent smells really good. So if I do decide to keep rebuying the skin cement, this is what I'll be using. It's almost empty. So when that is empty, then I will start using the Silky Shave Oil. Now, if I decide this is from Bath & Body Works, Coconut Oil and Vitamin E. If I decide that this works better than the skin to me, or makes my skin feel better since it's an oil, then I'll continue to buy this. But shave products, I just won't have, you know, multiples of it because I don't see a reason for myself um, to have so many of it. Um, you guys know I use the same type of razor. This is the only razor I use, and this is a chic razor looks like that i want to say it has five blades. yes it has five blades the blades are you can take them off pop them back on and then this end has clippers that you can use so this is the only razor that i use i love the shave that i get from the um actual razor side and then i use the clipper side also so the next thing i'm going to talk about is what i'm using right now is my feminine wash I'm using the Honey Pot Feminine Wash. I know everybody loves this. I I don't dislike it. I mean, I'm using it and it, it works. But you know, you guys know what my favorite is. And right now, she is not, um, she's not taking orders right now. I think she, had, she either has had her baby or is about to have her baby. So she stopped taking orders. Um, and it's Goddess Body, if you guys are wondering, for those of you that are new here. But uh, that's what my favorite skin like um vagina washes and it's awesome i love lemongrass and it smells like lemongrass so until i can order from her again i'm gonna keep using the honey pot and i'll probably still keep one of these on hand or whatever but that was my favorite but i'm using honey pot at the moment 
So the next thing, this stuff that I'm talking to you about first is the stuff that I had in the shower. And that's why it's all separate right here. You guys can't see that. But I wanted to go ahead and get this stuff out of the way because it is a part of my collection. But it's what I'm using in the shower currently. So the next two things I want to show you um, that I have are these Olay in the shower moisturizers. This one's the nighttime rinse off body conditioner with B3 and retinol. This one's the B3 in shea butter. They smell different, but they both smell really good. I use this one at nighttime and I use this one in the daytime. Uh, and I'll use this one at night also depending on the type of body wash that I use, but they feel really great when the, the time changes and the seasons change. And then of course with me taking hot showers around my collarbone right here, my skin tends to get really, really, really dry. Between me using this in the shower and then putting Vaseline on when I get out of the shower, it's completely gone. And I normally have to deal with it the entire time the season is different, like when it gets around fall and winter. But it's gone and I did it for a couple of weeks and then I got rid of it. So the body washes that I'm using in the shower right now are the Caress Shea Butter and Brown Sugar and also the uh, OGX Coconut Coffee Scrub Body Wash. I had talked to you guys about this before. Um, for those of you that smell it in a store and you do not like it, trust me, buy it and give it a try and take a shower with it and I guarantee you, you'll change your mind. But these are the two that I'm using in the shower right now. And um, as far as my backside, the, the body wash, I didn't take it out of the shower that I'm using is a Dove antibacterial, um, I don't know what the scent is, but it's in there and I didn't take it out, but it's okay. So on to the stuff that I have not touched yet. The next thing I want to talk to you about is the show you is the method chamomile starflower blue lavender. This one is called wind down. It smells really good. I'm not going to go through sniffing this stuff and smell it. I've smelled it already. That's why I have it. I'm just going to show you guys what's in my collection and move along so that this video is not super duper long. So we have wind down and then we have Olay notes of watermelon and agave looks like that and then we have i bought this and i have skipped all around this it smells good but for some reason i have not grabbed it to um try it and i need to because it's been a few months since i bought this and it's been sitting there but uh i got this from marshall's yep but it's just called flower perfume perfume body wash uh so on my cart and I have this right here. This is what I keep next to the shower with all of my, I keep most of my extras on here. The body wash is normally at the bottom, then scrubs and then scrubs on the top. So next we have tea, um, all of these are gonna be tree hut. Tree hut coconut lime. Tree Hut Frosted Sugar Cookie. Smells like sugar cookie, has a really soft scent. Tahitian Vanilla Bean. So we have um, Shea Sugar Scrub Coconut. Lemon Blueberry Tart. Smells like Trix Cereal. Cocoa Colada. Tropical Glow Firming Scrub. Exotic Bloom. Watermelon. Vitamin C. Turmeric. I don't know why I'm trying, trying to be in the camera. Y'all know what I look like. I just need to show y'all the stuff. Show me the goods. <laughs> Cotton candy. Still trying to be in the camera. Cotton candy. Well, I'm kind of trying to make sure you guys can see. Moroccan rose. Eucalyptus blossom. Yeah. Tropical mango. Yeah. 
And then we have Onyx Bathhouse Unicorn Dreams. Goddess by Onyx Bathhouse. We have a small Onyx Bathhouse. This is in Champagne Wishes. Soul Janeiro and the Boom Boom Cream. Onyx Bathhouse Hot Mess. Onyx Bathhouse Mermaid Goddess. No, Mermaid Goals. Sorry. All of the Onyx Bathhouse ones, if you guys don't know, they are foaming body scrubs. The, fo the foam. Oh, I love it. The next one we have is You're the One Sparkling Body Scrub. Then we have another Olay Rinse Off Body Conditioner. This is the extra that is out here when I run out. Then we have a small um, shower cream from Sol de Janeiro. Next scrubs we have are the Dove Exfoliating Body Polish scrubs. Their scrubs, I have not even touched this one, but their scrubs are really soft. A lot of times I use these scrubs for my armpit, that and the coconut wine one. I like to use these under my armpit. They look, oh, it smells so good. It looks like that on the inside. Really whipped looking. This one is the mango, crushed almond and mango butter. The next one is pomegranate seeds and shea butter. You can kind of see this one more. You see those little beads in there? You see, you see, you see? Yep. Yeah. Oh, that one's running, okay. Smells, oh, I should have got the pomegranate lotion. It does smell. Now watch when I go back to Target, it won't happen. So the next thing I'm gonna show you guys are the body washes. You, you guys, y'all know how much I was buying body washes. Well, I have went through so many of my body washes. Like I showed you guys those three because they're sitting right here and I can move them down here actually. But the ones that I have on my rack, I have gotten down so good. And I stopped buying them because I was trying to use up what I had. And Keelan is using some of them, but the last one she used, she said she didn't like it. But, so I have the Olay B3 and Collagen body wash. And then I have Olay, somebody's been using this one. <laughs> hmm, I know who. Then I have the Olay Exfoliating Moisture Sea Salt Complex B3 body wash. It looks like that. Well, at least I know it's not just sitting there. Then the Olay Charcoal and Mint. I also have this Desert Wildflower from Bath and Body Works. I don't buy a lot of these for some reason. I bought this one because this is one of my favorite scents from them. And I still haven't touched that one. And it is, as you can see, there's this one. <laughs> the next thing I have is this Rose Water and Pink Sea, Pink Sea Salt uh, Scrub Wash. I have not used this one yet. Keela normally takes this one from me. I didn't even know this one was under here, but there it is. And then I have one of my faves. It's the Caress Daily Silk White Peach and Orange Blossom. I have the big one with the pump because I love this one. And then I have the Arm & Hammer Essentials Body Wash. And this one is in clear water. I have the Soft Soap Lustrous Glow Rose and Vanilla. It's really pretty. It looks like that. OGX Coconut Miracle Oil Body Wash. Looks like that, you guys have all seen. I'm scared to use this one because I'm afraid it will not lather. And of course I have an extra Dr. Bronner's Peppermint Soap. And then I have this Olay B3 Hyaluronic Acid Cream Body Wash Combo. 
So guys, that is all the body wash that I have. Can y'all believe it? To the salon! Okay guys, so we're on to the next part. I have a bunch of these Victoria's Secret um, sprays, but I'm honestly not gonna put these in the collection video because I don't ever wear these. It's something about Victoria's Secret sprays that just kind of throw me off. I don't know what it is, but so I'm not gonna waste your time or mine and put those in there. So I only have two uh, body sprays from Victoria's Secret that I'm gonna show you guys. That is the Golden Bloom um, and Victoria's Secret Gold Stroke. Those are the only two that I will grab for. The next one is Bath and Body Works, of course. It is Rose. I have Cocktail Dress. A lot of these you guys probably well, you maybe you will recognize because y'all look sis just like me. This one is Champagne Toast. <laughs> Oldie. Then I have Pink Confetti. You're the one. I love this scent. It is really strong. It smells so perfumed. There's a big difference in Bath and Body Works sprays from when they created things like Champagne Toast compared to You're the One. These new scents. I honestly don't even reach for these old ones anymore. I just have not gotten rid of them, which I probably should, but I have not. <clears throat> um, this one is Love and Sunshine. I never wear this. I'll probably throw this away. Then I have A Thousand Wishes, Mad About You, Desert Wildflower, Boardwalk Taffy, Lush Pink, never wear it, might delete later. <laughs> Amber Blush, Perfect Peony, In the Stars, smells amazing. Velvet Sugar, I always keep this, this is one of my sleep scents. French Lavender and Honey. At the beach, absolute fave. I have a combo, um, a shower routine, like combination on here. Um, I don't know how far down, but if you guys want to scroll on down, which you should, and watch all of my videos, then you'll see the layering combination that I have for this. I absolutely love this spray. Margarita cupcake. Paris Nights. If you, as you can see, I buy these sprays and don't even use them hardly once I buy them. My scents change that fast. And then I have Sweater Weather. I have like two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen. I have nineteen other sprays up here that I'm not going to show you guys because I honestly should just throw them away. <laughs> but those are all of the body sprays that I'm going to show you guys and we're going to move on to my lotions and body butters. I was sitting here thinking like the ones that I didn't want to show you guys or I didn't feel the need to show you guys. Maybe if I didn't want to show you guys, I could just, I should, that means that I should just trash them, right? <laughs> so next we're going to do the lotions. For the lotion, first lotion, I have this Yardley. Um, oatmeal and almond lotion. I bought this lotion from Dollar Tree, actually, and it smells so good. It smells clean and almondy. Is that a word? Nope. <laughs> Next, I have Vaseline Cocoa Radiant. I'm gonna have to turn you guys because there's a okay. And I have Vaseline Cocoa Radiant Intensive Care Lotion. You know what, I like the smell of these Vaseline lotions, but what I don't care for is that they make me feel sticky once I go to bed. So it makes me not wanna use them. Then next I have the uh, Essential Healing. Um, yeah, that's the only thing in there. And then it says keeps dry heal for weeks without feeling greasy. Lies, lies, I tell you lies. <laughs> 
I feel sticky, maybe not, you know, kind of greasy and sticky. The next thing I want to show you is this coconut coffee body cream. Uh, as far as I know, you cannot find this in the store. You have to order this off Amazon. That's where I found it at because I have not seen it anywhere else. The next thing I have is this Jergens Deep Restoring Argan. Um, Argan oil and vitamin E for extra dry skin. First lotions, well, these are the ones for my shelf. So this one is the um, MFK. This is the Baccarat Rouge 540 lotion. Woo! And then I have the Truly Beauty Unicorn CBD with Body Butter, Butter Soothe and Glow. I actually wanted to start making these myself. Of course, it wasn't going to be with the CBD and stuff like that in it or whatever. Mine was just going to be um, with Body Butters, but I wanted to do the unicorn look on them. Still out. The jury's still out on it. I really want to do it. I just haven't started because I have so much going on and I'm constantly trying to add something else. Then I have the uh, Johnson Baby Cologne. Oh, forgot to show you guys this spray. I have the Brazilian Crush. I don't know why I have this over here. It's in the wrong spot. That's why I forgot to show you. Then I have a Boom Boom Cream. Random over here. Sea Salt Hair Mist from Midsummer Dream. Bedroom Candy French Kiss. This is supposed to be a pheromone lotion. Prada Candy. Bulgari Omnia Coral. Taylor Swift Wonderstruck. Liv Jennifer Lopez. Laura Mercier Almond Coconut. Absolutely love it. I do want the Vanilla Souffle. I just am trying to be good and not order any more body care products until I use most of the stuff I have up. <laughs> that was the promise I made. Why did I do that? Next is the Tree Hut um, with Marula Oil Focus and Jasmine Extract. Tree Hut Moroccan why is it not focusing? Moroccan oil. Watermelon. Tropical Glow Firming Whipped Shea Body Butter. All of the body butters. Dirty Works, the Big Softy Body Butter. You guys, if you, I got this from Marshalls. It was... $4.99. They have now marked this up to $5.99, I think. But if you can find it at your Marshalls, get it. It smells absolutely amazing. It smells good. And it feels really good on. Dove Beauty Cream. Righteous Butter. This one is... Well, this soap is soap and glory, righteous butter. I have had this so long, and it's so funny that this stuff is all of a sudden blew up in the beauty, uh, the hygiene community. And I've had this has been out for shoot as long as I feel like as long as Target has been open. I've had it a very long time. Then we have EOS. You guys know this is my absolute favorite. I went to Target today. You know, y'all know I was fussing about the raspberry and pomegranate. They actually had it today, and they had a coconut waters one. I wanted to buy both of them <laughs> just because, but I didn't need either one of them. Coconut waters was really light, so I wasn't gonna get that one. I think I may go back and get them. My daughter was like, you need to get them because if you come back, they're not going to be there because the raspberry one has not been there for months and today they had so many. But I'm going to give it some thought, but you guys know this is my favorite lotion. Then we have the Bath and Body Works lotion. I have Amber Blush. Thousand Wishes. Charmed Life. I think I can throw this away because I think I threw the spray away. P.S. I love you. This is berry vanillas. This smells so good and this is old. I hold the summer berry vanillas. 
I've had both of them because every time it comes out, I buy them and it is so hard to find them. So I really don't even use them, but I don't throw them away because it's one of my favorites. You can tell I love the Velvet Sugar. Lush Pink. Love and Sunshine. Paris Amour. French Lavender and Honey. Then we have Strawberry Pound Cake. I do not have the spray in this because I only bought the lotion because it was like $2. Perfect Peony. You're the one. I don't know how I feel about Bay. <laughs> Other Bay. <laughs> As a matter of fact, I have two of these. Actually, I have three of these. I have one at work that I keep at work. So I guess this is Bay. <laughs> Pure said, God, this is old. I'm not even gonna show y'all this. I'm gonna show you this because I do like this. My area want me this, I think. Strip, sun, sunset strip, it's almost gone. Then we have pink confetti. Pink chiffon. Rose. Lemon pomegranate cream. You can tell I really like this one. I bought two of them. Ordered them from Amazon. No, I take that back. I bought two of these in store. This is the one that's my absolute favorite that I ordered. Track down order from Amazon. And I think I paid like 20 something dollars for this lotion because they stopped selling it in Bath and Body Works. And the people on Amazon were killing the price on this lotion. But it was one of my favorites. And this one's full because... I stopped using it but the thing I don't like about this one it oils really bad on the inside and none of my lotions do that so I don't really use it because of that boardwalk taffy in the stars Victoria's Secrets oh this is Victoria look at me reading the whole thing gold struck margarita cupcake cocktail dress then I have two more Victoria's Secret lotions. We have Champagne Toast and Passion Struck. All right, guys, so that's it. That is the end of my video. I hope you enjoyed my hygiene collection video. If you did, before you leave my channel, would you do me a favor and hit the subscribe button? Drop below in the comments and let me know what you guys think. Let me know who you are. Say what's up. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.